Hello students. Today we are going to study about the topic routine systems and records of housekeeping department. In this topic we will discuss about various routine systems and records which are followed in housekeeping department and why they are made. So there are various reports and records which are maintained in housekeeping department. The list goes reporting staff placement room occupancy report guest room inspection checklist work order maintenance job order lost and found register and inquiry file guest special request register call register records of special cleaning floor register and handover records this is not the total list there are many other records and reports which are maintained in housekeeping department but these are few of them and we will study accordingly when they are required in today's class we are going to discuss about the first two reports that is room staff placement or oh sorry reporting staff placement and room occupancy report reporting staff placement in this we will discuss about the staff when they report for the duty what all things we do and duty roster once uh, once the staff report for the duty in the morning shift first thing they do they punch in their attendance and then they change to the uh, department clothing and then they report on duty and the first thing in the morning shift or in any of the shift we do is the briefing part in briefing uh, there are various things which are discussed so here is a list of few of them first thing which is discussed in the morning shift is reports in reports there are many reports which we get from front office department like about vips vips about to arrive in the hotel vips their uh, likes and dislikes vips already staying in the hotel then check in and check out it can be individual ones and it can be group one and many others like likes and dislikes of the guests then a dnd dnd is do not disturb in this we discuss about the rooms which are not serviced or which are not opened for last 24 hours and how to open a room that we have already discussed in the last class any message here we discuss about any message from the guest or from any of the staff to the next shift messages are basically given in the logbook which is uh, used in briefing like uh, we read the messages from the logbook in the briefing at the start of the shift then job allocation that which person goes to which floor job allocation is basically already done in the duty roster but still there are absenteeism or leave by the staff so we have to allocate allocate duties then on spot then appreciation yes appreciation is one thing which is required which is very much required by everyone so that uh, it it helps in uh, morale uh, this uh, morale boosting and it should be done in front of everyone so these are the things which are discussed in the briefing next slide is about duty roster here you can see uh, i have given the floor names 2a 2b 3rd a 3rd b 4th a 4th b this shows a and b shows about the different sections of the floor then name of the employees and days of the weeks here three shifts are there morning shift afternoon shift and night shift second a and second b that is one floor two persons are there third a and third b again one floor two sections are there and in total six employees are there in the morning shift one is reliever two employees in the afternoon shift and again two employees in the night shift here in duty roster every employee have to be given one off and reliever is the one who compensate his or her duty on that day next report what we will discuss today is a room occupancy report room occupancy report is basically a physical check of the room what 
uh, about the physical occupancy in the room it is checked by the housekeeping department and a report is generated basically occupancy report helps us to communicate with the front office department about the occupancy this report is made three times a day and it is made after a physical check in the room and for making this report there are various room codes which are uh, which we have which we write on the report the format of the report i'll show in the next slide these are the room codes which are used for filling up the report we write v for vacant triple o for out of order expected departure check out check in service refused dnd service later sleep out there are various codes which we require to write in the format next slide is about the room occupancy report format and i'll show you how you fill uh, the codes over there here goes the slide it's a room occupancy report top right corner you can see the shift various shifts morning afternoon and evening for whichever shift it is or at the time of the day at which time the report is uh, you are making the report take the appropriate section then you write the date and the time yes time is very much important so that you can have a check that what time the report is made and then you can see three columns one is room number tax and status floor wise it is written over there i have taken four floor uh, three floors and on the right side the codes are written those codes need to be filled let's suppose room number 201 is vacant that means it's not occupied vacant and ready so in tax you will write nil and status will be v that means vacant let's suppose 202 has two guests we will write 02 or 2 and in status we will write occupied same way 203 is maintenance block we will write nil in the packs and status triple o out of order 204 let's suppose it is it was on dnd and we don't know how many guests were there we will leave that column blank and in the status we will write dnd so that this room can be serviced later on once the dnd is removed and at the bottom of the sheet once all the floor reports are uh, entered into this then it is signed by the housekeeping department and sent it uh, we sent this report to the front office department and then front office tallies it with their uh, their count what they have in their records and in case any mismatch occurs then generates the report from front office side which is known as discrepancy report discrepancy report is basically a mismatch between the housekeeping physical check and the front office occupancy report that's all for today and in the next class we will discuss about next two reports of housekeeping department that is guest room inspection checklist and maintenance job order thank you thank you very much yes sir 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 yes sir